Hi, I'm Santosh Chahan. I'm group leader at CSIRC CMB. Our lab tries to understand how our body cells deals with external and internal threats. The external threats are like invasion of bacteria, viruses, or other pathogens. The internal threats are like damaged mitochondria or other organelles in the cell, which leads to inflammation. Excess inflammation could lead to different alterations in the cells. That includes the genomic alterations. Significant genomic alterations can make cell cancerous. Our body has different mechanisms to deal with these stresses. Specifically, our lab works on two processes, autophagy and inflammation. Autophagy is cell autonomous, cell cleansing process, which can clean the cells of all the possible irritants. Autophagy can take care of both internal and external threats. Specifically, we are interested how autophagy reduces the inflammation. Access inflammation can lead to cell death and autoimmunity. Autophagy is one of the process which can take care of access inflammation. Our lab tries to understand the mechanism by which autophagy suppresses the inflammation. In addition to that, we are interested how host antiviral immune system works. Specifically, we are interested in interferon system. Interestingly, these interferon pathways are not only antiviral but also anti-cancer. We are interested to boost the immunity of body. Moreover, we are taking both unbiased and structural-based approach to identify small molecules or drug molecules that could induce antiviral and anti-cancer immunity. We are using multiple techniques such as biochemical techniques, cell biological techniques and molecular biology techniques to identify the mechanism by which these drugs and small molecules work against cancer or viruses. We all know that COVID-19 caused by the SARS-CoV-2 virus had crippled the world for almost three years. I wanted to understand how the host immune system respond to infection by different strains of SARS-CoV-2 and I found out that if the body has a strong innate immune system, it can put up a strong defensive antiviral response to different strains of SARS-CoV-2, including the most virulent Delta strain. In Humanized Mice model, we have found out that constitutive expression of a particular innate immune system can confer protection against pathogenesis by SARS-CoV-2 and other dreaded viruses. Currently, I am looking into the interaction of these different host immune system with other human viruses like the Japanese encephalitis virus and the chikungunya virus. Hi, I am Santos. I am working on understanding the cancer immune responses. Specifically, I am trying to use multiple new methods to boost the host immune responses against cancer. I use the mouse tumor model to discover the new technique that can boost the invasion of immune cells inside the tumor. It's resulting in tumor cell killing and it's clear. Innate immune response is the first line of host defense. The human interferon system is a major host arsenal against the invading pathogens like viruses, microbes and even cancer. Our lab is interested in identifying novel protein candidates by high throughput screening which can act as strong modulators of interferon response. We decipher the mechanism of these proteins by using conventional and high-end techniques in cell lines and animal models. In our lab, we also use RNA and protein sequencing, western blots, QRT-PCR, immunofluorescence, immunohistochemistry and protein-protein interaction techniques.